Hi everyone, Angela here. In this video, I'll show you how to make these cute little tiny scrunchies. They're great for babies, toddlers, and adults, and you can even use them for doll hair. You'll need a strip of lightweight fabric measuring 14 inches by one and a half inches, and you'll also need six inches of quarter inch wide elastic. Fold one end over to the wrong side, about 3 eighths of an inch, and then fold the piece in half lengthwise with right sides together. Using a quarter of an inch seam allowance, start with the back tack and stitch the long sides together. About half an inch before the end of the fabric, stitch with just a slightly bigger seam allowance and back tack. With this tapered end, it'll be a little bit easier to join together. Separate the fabric a little bit and then insert a safety pin to turn this tube right side out. If you're finding this video helpful, make sure to like, share, subscribe and turn on all notifications and leave a comment below. Once it's turned over, make sure to straighten out that folded edge on both sides. Remove the safety pin from the other end and straighten out. Next, insert the safety pin into the elastic and then thread it through the tube starting from the folded end. When there's still about two inches of elastic exposed, use a fabric clip to hold it in place. Continue threading it through and then push all of the fabric towards the center of the elastic. Make sure that the fabric isn't twisted. Remove the safety pin and the clip and overlap the ends of the elastic about half an inch. Then stitch across three or four times so that it's nice and strong. Now it's a good time to check if the elastic is the right size for your hair and shorten it if you need to. Now pull the folded end over this join so that it's out of the way. Now push in the ends together about 3 eighths of an inch. Match up the side seams and then close this opening with an edge stitch. Start in the center of the tube, stitch to one edge and then back tack to the other edge and back again. Trim your threads and then stretch out your scrunchie and push the gathers over the join. Make sure to check out some of my other videos. Thanks again for watching. Until next time, take care and happy sewing.